In commemoration of International Women's Day on Thursday, the 8th of March 2024, Senators of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, led by Senate President Gosul Akbabio, suspended the plenary to celebrate women senators by cutting a cake to mark the day. In celebration of the day, members of the House of Representatives has resolved to review all of gender-based legislation of the Night Assembly on women's participation in politics and other sectoral matters. This is in recognition of the accomplishment of women worldwide, including those in Nigeria. I want to believe seriously that a lot has been done by all of different organizations, the international communities, even in Nigeria, for us, the NGOs, for us to increase what we have. And I want to believe by the grace of God, we are going to increase that number by the next election. However, I want to encourage women not to rest on their hours. Some have been out, they've contested, they've, not, they've lost the election. And as such, uh, they are kind of, they've withdrawn. This is not the time to withdraw. It is time to continue to push and as long as we, we continue to push, by the grace of God, they will see the potential in you and give you the support that you need. That is now the thing for, the okay. Well, uh, quite a number of the bills that were, that were presented to you, uh, I mean, previously in the National Assembly, the women in, the national, in this tent assembly are working seriously on it. And by the grace of God, we will hope to bring some of them back. And, um, just for us to get the consensus amongst, amongst the men, we are again discussing with them and we hope that by the grace of God, when those bills are returned back to the Senate, they will be given the desired, desired support. As we celebrate the International Women's Day, we should have it at the back of our mind that women are grossly underrepresented in the decision-making process and it's a clarion call on us to take deliberate steps with a view to bring about, bringing about inclusivity in governance, particularly with regard to gender representation of women in governance.